Hello, another blue sky day. However, it's quite chilly because it's early and I've only got a t-shirt on because well, there's a method in my madness. Oh yeah, <laughs> lovely t-shirt, glorious I told you, but there is a method in my madness. Um, as some of you may know, I've been having a load of blood tests and what have you for this um, fatigue that I've been feeling and um, you know everything else that goes along with it uh, anyway I've got results through I've, I've got to wait for one more um, blood test in a few days while I'm making this this is getting on for the end of April so um, we'll be sorted by May won't we a bit of luck anyway time will tell um, so they have discovered and it's not a bad thing, well not really, they've discovered that I'm quite low in vitamin D. That's the main thing, but also I'm on the borderline of uh, low, lowness, lowness. I'm on the, come here boat, come here, come, no come here, what are you doing? Right, good boy, you sit, thank you. In fact, come here, come here, that's it. Wow. He wanted to be running off then. So many dogs. Um, yeah, so the lowness side of things is also vitamin uh, B12. So vitamin D and vitamin B12. Uh, the vitamin B12, uh, they're sending me 90 tablets. So it's one a day for three months. And he said, if you can buy your um, vitamin D, you can buy it anywhere. Buy, if you're going to buy it, buy vitamin D3. You can buy it from supermarkets and... Uh, pharmacies. You can buy it wherever, really, you know. You can buy it from all over the place. Uh, I got mine from the internet. It's on its way. But uh, as long as it's a reputable um, company sort of thing that you know of. No, stay there a minute. Oh, sitting on a little bench. There we go. <laughs> so, yeah, um, let me just tell you for a second about, um, come here please, about vitamin D, uh, or the lack of it. They reckon that if you've had COVID, then probably 60% of people have now low vitamin D. Um, if you live in the UK or a country like the UK, then you're probably gonna have low vitamin D as well. They reckon it's 75% because most of the time we've only got our face and hands exposed to the sunshine, hence, um, hence a, a lovely t-shirt. So uh, I've now got an excuse for walking around my village, start bollock naked. The looks you get, eh? The looks. So if you've read this on Facebook, um, then I do apologise. I'm really making this for the people that don't go onto Facebook or the people that can't read. <laughs> so, uh, vitamin D, um, the low side of vitamin D, uh, causes lots of different things, including chronic tiredness, well, that's me, constant headaches, that's me. Um, oh, and a number of other things, really. Um, and when I look at it all, you know, chat with the doctor on the phone, I thought, Christ, he's just describing me, you know, the aches and pains and, and all the rest of it that goes along with it. That's how I've been feeling for probably a year. Um, so it'd be nice to get on top of that but when you start taking vitamin D and as I say it's vitamin D3 that's the one you want when you start taking that it's about six weeks four to six weeks before you notice any change any difference um, so it's quite a while and um, you've got to take that for a, a minimum of three months so I've ordered six months worth and it's cheap it was a fiver or, or whatever it was I don't know um, the reason why you go for vitamin D3 rather than vitamin D2 
vitamin D2. Bodhi, you're licking. Is a synthetic um, form of uh, vitamin. Um, the uptake in the body is a long, long time and what have you. So, um, and it's just, some people struggle with it for whatever reasons. Bode, make sure you don't lick, I'm watching. Vitamin D3 comes from natural things um, and it works much quicker and it holds on in the body much longer. So it boosts the um, vitamin D easier, better, quicker and all the rest of it. So um, yeah, vitamin D3 is the one you want. So if you do feel like I've been feeling, just knackered, <laughs> bit headachey, bit achy, bit um, oh low mood. Did I say low mood as well? Because the um, vitamin D deficiency um, does a lot of different stuff, but it's not only making you feel knackered; it also um, lowers your mood. And obviously, I've got dysthymia, so I've got a low mood anyway for a lot of the time. And when I get a lower mood that can cause a spike in my anxiety so uh, yeah it's important that we get these things sorted um, so you can either if you think that's you you can go to the doctor simple little blood test and within a couple of days they can tell you about three days um, whether you've got low vitamin D or low B12 and uh, Start you on a course of things, you know, supplements, and away you go, you'll be all right, hopefully. Um, but if you don't, don't want to go to the doctor, if this sounds a little bit like you, just give it a try, because it's not going to hurt you. Vitamin D, three, number three. Uh, try that for minimum of three months. One tablet, once a day, and uh, see how you get on. It's incredible really, I've only been out 20 minutes, I've got, my legs are shaking, all their tires, I feel breathless, um, knackered, <laughs> you know, so hopefully there's going to be a change in me, give me six months and uh, I'll be running the marathon. Uh, bit, um, vitamin B12, very good for the immune system, very good for the red blood count. Um, it's an important, um, a very important vitamin that we have within our system. So if you are low on that, um, you know, that's a blood test really that can tell you that. And uh, again, your doctor can supply you 90 days worth of tablets. Just one a day. Look at my little boy, look. Hey, hey no. Come here, look. Come here, you've got stuff on you. What a state. There you go. Glorious tree. Come here, come here. Bird. Oh, he does take no notice. Wow, there's a big old squirrel up there. Wow. Huge. Come on. <laughs> Hiya. <laughs> come on, mister. It's beautiful, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, it's going to warm up. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> come on then. Um, so yeah, vitamin B12 is a really important um, thing, but it does, you know, important within the system, but it does the same, similar to um, a deficiency of vitamin D. And it makes you tired, makes you lethargic, makes you feel a bit out of breath, blah, blah, blah. So we'll have a look at some blue bells for a change. We normally look at DAFs when I come here these you've got white blue bluebells and then bluebells bluebells are always purple or lilac there's a that's lilac without any shadow of a doubt and uh, I'd say that's purple but whatever glorious and things are really turning now Things are getting starting of their summer colours and what have you, which is glorious. All this lot was quite bare and barren just three weeks ago. I mean, look at that. It's lovely. Come on, Bode, come away from that dirty water. 
You always end up with black feet, you do. Come on, my friend. Bode. I know, you're licking, I know. You can't help it, can you? I can hear a woodpecker in the distance. Can you hear him? I don't know if this little lapel mic picks him up. Old Bode. I'm losing the bloody trousers here. Honestly, if you could see me. Because the trousers that I've got on, they're a bit, um, a bit loose and baggy. Because I like them like that. And what I normally do is wear like, like a little light jacket or something. Something rather glorious. And I can put his B-A-L-L in that. Put my wallet in it, my phone, my car keys. So I've got everything stuffed in these two pockets. And the weight of it all is pulling everything down and my bare ass is hanging out. But that's fine, because I'm allowed. Because um, vitamin D on the ass, that's what the doctor says. My excuse. Wow. We're getting nearer to Mr. Woodpecker. So he's on that walk through there, we might as well go that way and then head on round. We can play as a woman look, looking for the woodpecker. I think he's that, she's in the right area. I'll push her out of the way with my naked body. So get out of the way. I'm vitamin D deficient. Yeah, so if you are concerned, you can um, do your own research, obviously. I'm not a doctor, or am I? Or am I? Um, we're missing these little bluebells, but I've shown you them. They're glorious, aren't they? Lovely. It's such a wonderful time of year. You've got crocuses and tulips, and obviously the glorious, crazy daffodils. And then we've got the... Um, you get beds of these sometimes, these bluebells that are purple. So it is a wonderful time of year. Right, we're going to kick that woman off on my path. Yeah, so I'm not a doctor, so do your own research. Just type it into Google or whatever, you know. Uh, vitamin D or vitamin D deficiency or low vitamin D, whatever you want to type. The choice is yours. Okay. Wow, it's wet through here. Oh, that bloody woman's here and all my jaws are falling down. Look at that. Hiya. Must have heard me. Oh. No, I'll tell you something that my um, doctor said that was a bit curious. He said about a lot of us, especially being English, uh, we only got our hands and faces in the sunshine. Obviously, do it safely. Both, you're licking. Don't go out um, between 12 and 3 and burn yourself to a bloody cinder, because obviously of reasons, but this time of morning, it's about quarter to nine now. We left at about half eight, I think. No, 20 past eight. So maybe it's um, half nine, half, I don't know what a bloody time is, do I? Um, but it's, it's cold, but bright and sunny. And actually, when I stop, I can feel 
sunshine on me, so it's quite warm. But if you give this another three, four, five hours, it'd be piping hot, which then is quite dangerous. You don't want to blister your skin up. So, as I say, I'm not a doctor. You can do your own research and uh, make up your mind whether you want to just start yourself on vitamin D. Bode. Bode. This way. They've lost their dog. I haven't seen her. Didn't see any dogs. Can't hear one either. Oh, they've got a. Ah. Yeah, so you can either start yourself on vitamin D if you think that that might help you, especially if you've had COVID, or you live in the UK, or you don't get out in the sunshine much, or you're not scared to um, walk about start bollock naked, like me. Okay. That's been knackered, so I'm going to stop here and play B-A-L-L, because you see him, that's what he wants to be doing, bless him. Yeah, so you can either go to the doctor and um, just say I've had COVID and I feel really tired since and, you know, uh, a bit headachey. And um, the odd thing is, right, I'm absolutely exhausted, but I can't really sleep at night very well. Keep waking up. It's ridiculous, but it is what it is. So anyway, look at this glorious place we're in. Just look at that. How wonderful. The woods have such a quiet energy. I love it. Might come back as a tree. <laughs> have a dog piss up me. Oh, I'm a poet and I don't know it. Might come back at a tree and have a dog piss at me. The tree is free. Okay, I'm going to have to play. But yeah, so the good thing is, there is nothing much to worry about. Uh, three months on the B12, the vitamin B12. That's a little tiny tablet from the doctor. And at least three months on the uh, vitamin D. I'm gonna give myself six months, why not? And try and get rid of this bloody tiredness, this, the aches and pains, the low mood. I'm gonna do everything I possibly can with the mood because of my dysthymia. So I know the levels that I'm at kind of thing, you know. Um, you know, and I'm just stuck really at the moment. I'm not depressed, but I'm stuck in a, a lower mood than I would normally be at this time of year. So, if you can get outside, you know. How wonderful. Okay. He's desperate to play, so uh, don't forget, we've got a premiere on Thursday, I believe it's the 25th. Oh yes, it is, 25th of May. As I'm making this, it's the end of April. So by saying May, you're probably saying, well, of course it's bloody May. That's the month we're in, because this video will probably take a little while to come out. I think I've got four to come out in the next two weeks, really. So um, I'm a little bit ahead, so it's all good. Okay, enjoy your day, whatever you do. And uh, we'll be back another day. Okay, take care then. Be well.